to another video and today in the video guys we're going to be talking about how to use the action bar command in your minecraft game for your minecraft maps or if you guys just want to use it in general minecraft experience so let's get to it so all you guys have to do in order to activate the action bar command is you do dash title at a action bar and then all you guys need to do if you guys want to add different kind of font color you guys can simply go ahead and use this symbol here which is the two kind of merged s's as well as and then you type in the color that you want. So if you want it to be two, you can have it as two. If you want it as one, you can do one. If you want to do three, you can do three. If and you want, you can either do, you can do L, or you can do, or you can just have the font as it is. So you can do, you can set it to B for bold. So you can have it as, and you can just simply. It's really, really simple on how you guys do use it. Just. Make sure you guys are aware of what you guys are doing when you use it. You can make it all caps or you can do bold if you want it to be in bold like so. So that is how you guys do that. You guys can also see it with the bold. Uh, you can also see it as the just capitalized. Um, but how you guys do it in command now. So all you guys have to do in a command is you just remove the dash. So you do title. So you do title. And if you guys want it to be permanent, this is how you do it by the way. So you do title, so try that in title, at A, because you assumably want it to be all players. If you want it to be something else, then um, type something else, like RP or whatever. And then all you guys want to do is you guys then want to put the exact same as you guys had before. So you guys can do your little, you guys can do your little whatever you want it to be. And then you can put action bar. Then you can put action bar, you can put action bar before, as you should, as you guys did for the other one. And then all you guys have to do simply is you guys just put in whatever you want. So I'm going to put high, and then you guys can set it up to always active, and then you can set it up to repeating unconditionally. And then you can just see it will constantly stay on the screen. Um, so if you guys just want to get rid of it, you guys can just turn off the always active, and you guys can just clear it. So you guys can just go in dash action that's title you can go in title and then you can go clear at s at a clear reason then you can but if you want to just clear it all that's all you do so i hope you guys did enjoy this really quick little action bar tutorial let me know what you want to see next time below thank you so much for watching have an amazing rest of your day and i'll see you next time Bye bye